hello friends welcome to engineering tutorial so we'll continue our discussion with uh, the satellite communication system and so far we have discussed about the basic uh, introductory concepts related to satellite communication the need of a satellite communication system and about the satellite orbits uh, and some basic concepts about launching and positioning orbits and trajectories uh, about that so in this video we are going to discuss some basic terminologies associated with uh, this uh, satellite uh, position uh, in a, the orbital path so in this video we are going to discuss about satellite height satellite speed and satellite period okay so the first uh, parameter the first term is satellite height now we have already discussed that the orbit the definition of orbit which is a well defined path which is repeated or traversed again and again so when a satellite revolves around any planet uh, or earth it travels in a well defined path and that path is repeated over and over again so that is what the definition of an orbit is so the satellite height it gives us the information about the distance between the earth and the satellite orbiting around it now this satellite height it depends on the nature the geometry of the orbital path now we already know that orbits are basically of two types circular and elliptical so depending on whether the orbit is circular or elliptical the satellite height will be different it will vary so first let us discuss the satellite height in case of a circular orbit so in case of a circular orbit like this the satellite height is simply the distance of the satellite from the earth's surface okay from the surface of the earth to the satellite that is the uh, satellite height for geometric calculations sometimes the radius of the earth is also included okay now in that case it is measured from the geocenter which is the center of the earth the earth's mass so the satellite height in case of a circular orbit is the distance between the satellite in the well defined orbital path and the surface of the earth sometimes for geometric calculations for mathematical derivations and those purposes the radius of the earth measured from the geocenter is also included in the satellite distance so this is for the circular orbit now for the elliptical orbit so when the satellite is in an elliptical path okay around earth or any other planet the satellite height varies depending on its position okay the distance between the satellite and the earth's surface it will vary for example when the satellite is here the satellite distance the distance of the satellite from the earth's surface will be different when it is here it will be different when it is here it will be different and when it is here it will be different now the two positions which are of uh, considerable interest the important points are apogee and perigee now apogee is the maximum distance the maximum separation of the satellite from the surface of the earth the highest point and perigee is the minimum separation or the minimum distance between the surface of the earth and the satellite 
so this is the apogee the maximum separation from earth to the satellite this is the perigee the minimum separation between the satellite and the surface of the earth okay so this is satellite height in the elliptical orbit next is satellite speed so again the satellite speed it uh, depends and it varies with the distance from the surface of the earth because of the gravitational field which exists the gravitational pull of the earth now we all know that uh, during the, the previous video we discussed that a satellite is launched giving it some forward motion some forward velocity which has to be more than the gravitational field of earth so the upward velocity should be greater than the downward pull once it uh, escapes the gravitational pull the launch vehicle and the satellite they separate and the satellite moves in a well defined orbital path so this velocity the satellite speed as it moves around the orbit because of the gravitational pull even if it has escaped the gravitational pull there is some effect of the gravitational field of earth so it depends on that now typical satellite speed varies from 7000 miles per hour to 17000 miles per hour okay so this is this satellite speed next is the satellite period so the satellite period the basic definition of satellite period is the total time taken by the satellite to complete one orbital motion one complete revolution around the or the, the body the planet or any Uh, entity around which it is moving so one complete uh uh cover up of the total distance of the orbital path the time taken for that is called as the satellite period now it is also called as sidereal period now uh, the measurement of satellite period is a tricky task because suppose a satellite is moving around earth now to determine whether the satellite has completed one complete uh uh, uh the revolution one or complete orbital motion there has to be some reference point now as the earth is also moving it is moving around the sun it is also rotating about its axis so it becomes a uh, tricky to consider earth as the reference point because it is itself rotating around its axis and it is also moving around the sun so it is in continuous motion so all the points with respect to earth are also in motion so that's why some other distant stationary or motionless object such as sun or any star is used as the reference point now on the basis of that reference point the satellite period is determined because that object is motionless it is stationary so with respect to that the movement of the satellite around earth can be determined okay so this is the satellite period the total time taken by the satellite to complete one orbital motion be it a circular orbit or an elliptical orbit so here we have covered the three basic terms the satellite height uh for both circular and uh, elliptical orbits the satellite speed and satellite period okay so i hope you like this video and please subscribe my channel engineering tutorial for more such videos related to electrical electronics instrumentation and communication engineering have a great day
थैंक यू वेरी मच